Hi, Roxy Sandra. If you live in Orange County, you may have seen the plume of smoke this morning. It could be seen from miles away. A lot of it has dissipated, but we still have some activity here. Most of the flames are out. Uh, we can tell you that this damage done in the last few hours and this is the North Hangar, one of two on the former site of the Tustin Air Base. It's been burning since just before 1 o'clock this morning. We have video uh, to show you what it looked like a little earlier this morning, and that's when Orange County Fire Authority officials say they responded to the hangar fire near Warner and Armstrong Avenues, a massive, mostly wooden structure that has been here for decades. It's unclear what was being stored inside, if anything, but a real part of history for so many in this Orange County community and a lot of people have been lining up here on the street, unfortunately, watching parts of it burn to the ground. I heard that the hangar was on fire, so I, I, I got immediately in my car and rushed over and I saw it. And why, why are you so emotional? Because these are historic and they're beautiful. And they, they mean a lot to Tustin and Irvine. They're beautiful and I know they're not going to try to save them. I just started to cry. I was so sad. I just, every time I drive by here, I live a mile away. I love these hangers. They mean so much to our town. These two blimp hangars went up in 1942 during World War II at the former Tustin Air Base, two of the largest wooden structures in the country at 17 stories high, known as the titans of history. They've been featured in prominent film and TV shows, and the hangars owned by the Department of the Navy. Coming back out here live, we showed you the north hangar. This is the south hangar. It's untouched, but you get an idea of just how massive they are. The cause is unknown. Fire officials uh, say arson investigators are on the scene and it could be days before they determine a cause. Reporting live in Tustin, I'm Mario Ramirez. Back to you. Mario, thank you.